these are the, the realities in Ghana. The truth is this. Unlike La Côte d'Ivoire, Africa's, where all the lands belong to the government, so you can have plantation, cocoa plantation. In Ghana, uh, smallholder farmers make up all our cocoa yes, industry. Yes. One acre, two acres, three acres. This is my acreage that you're talking about. Yeah. It's not in one location. Okay. Yep, I have some here, I have some here. Okay. The one that is uh, one bulk land, which is um, 15 acres. Right. That is there. The rest are in bits okay. and pieces. Right. So these are smallholder farmers. Oh. So at the end of the year, but for the high tech, but for the cocoa high tech, mm -hmm. most of them would have even folded up to use the farms for some other things. Because of the high tech, the, the, the yield is small now. And yeah, uh, yeah so right. instead of getting, let's say, five bags per acre, you are now getting about 15 bags and all that. Yes. So if, if, if you do, you practice very good uh, agronomy, you will get the maximum yield. And then if you take good care of your, your, the money that will come, it can take you uh, 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 throughout the year. Or you can do some, something extra. See. So we are encouraging a lot of co-farmers to go to animal husbandry and that kind of thing. Okay.